Hey guys, how you doing? This is Manga Etc. And I'm here today to bring the review for Sakuma today's Manga Chapter 74. So off of last chapter, we find out that Sakamoto has failed. And there's a bit of a like, huh? Like what? Like how exactly did he fail? And now I thought it was a thing where, because I was looking at his test paper and there was two cancelled. So I was thinking, okay, maybe he, I don't know, missed the test or something like that. But it turns out at the end of the day, it's simply because he's a wanted man. So had he had gone in there with a disguise or just not used his real name because he doesn't really need a disguise because he doesn't look like he doesn't look like Prime Sakamoto. So if he just simply went in there with a false identity, he would have passed and he would have been able to infiltrate the JCC as a student. So we find this out very early. Shin is very mad at the fact that Sakamoto failed, so he calls them, he calls the school, and this is where we find out this piece of information. This leads to what we are now getting is which is going to be Sakamoto infiltrating in a different way and now when we got to the end of the chapter I'm not gonna lie I was slightly disappointed because the way the chapter sets things up in the early stages of it it makes you think that Mrs Sakamoto is going to be more involved in the story than she already is so Nagamo appears out of nowhere as he does and he's basically like okay cool if you can't infiltrate as a student infiltrate as a teacher but we find out that because um we basically find out that Sakamoto he can do this but he can't do this as him obviously they are known to be known to him as now if he can't um be a student as a wanted man he's most likely can't be a teacher as a wanted man as well so Nagamo says within the ch within the early stages of the chapter something on the lines of if it can't be you then it'll be, and then we point, and then this next panel we see Mrs. Sakamoto, and she's like, me, question mark. So it's making you think, okay, cool, she's going to be the one to infiltrate the school. And like I said, I was getting a little bit excited, because it would mean she would be more involved in the story, but at the same time, I was wondering if it is going to be her, she would need a lot of help because obviously she's not a trained assassin she doesn't know about infiltration blah blah blah, blah things of that nature but i was still <laughs> just a little bit excited about that fact but after that we flip over to akira i found her name akira um we just basically get in a little bit of the ins of outs of jcc school life and we see that she's kind of having just a little bit of a hard time of it but yeah and like i said previously we find out just like what school life is about and how hard things are going to be so we're following her around for a little bit until she reaches a class about um was it about infiltration no close qu um close quarters combat so she's looking for a close quarters combat class she ends up in the wrong class but eventually she finds the class so because of her late arrival the teacher decides to make an example of her, preparing up for some close quarters com combat um, practice with another student. And now, being a girl, being taller than her as well, the student is taking, is underestimating her potential and decides to make a show of her. And he goes in to attack, only for it to be stopped by Mr. Sakamoto. Now, at first, I thought this was Mrs. Sakamoto, so I was thinking, okay, maybe there was a little bit of, uh, no, because that doesn't really make sense now that I think about it, so, uh, I felt, okay, so, initial thought was that she was taught some stuff to help her during her time there, that makes sense, but I just for a second had a thought now that maybe over the years, Sakamoto did teach her some things, but I feel like Mrs. Sakamoto would be up for that and having like assassin teachers within her arsenal within her training because obviously she sees assassination as bad she made uh, Mr. Sakamoto stop that life but at the same time I feel like that could still be possible because Mr. Sakamoto could have convinced her to learn these things in self-defense so I feel like it still could be possible but yeah as I was thinking all of that thinking oh my gosh Mrs. Sakamoto is on the scene she's gonna be a bit of a assassin or so so why she's here but turns out not the case at all it's just mr sakamoto in disguise nagamo being nagamo was able to disguise sakamoto and he we do find out that this disguise will only last 24 hours now do i think things will be wrapped up within 24 hours no so i think 
we'll have this first trip maybe he'll get close or then he's gonna have to leave and maybe come back at a later date i don't think everything uh sakamoto wants to learn right here him and shin want to learn right here will be wrapped up within 24 hours i think something's gonna go wrong down the lines so yeah that's everything i got to say about this chapter it was a good chapter but I don't think it deserves any more than a three star rating. And that goes guys and also for your thoughts and opinions. If you haven't already, please go to my YouTube channel. Most importantly, take care. Have a nice day.